Well, folks, I think it's about time we talk about this because it's becoming somewhat of an issue. And it's none other than CW and what the fuckness. <laughs> what the fuckness. Kids, leave. Please, kids, leave. This is adult content because you're not going to get anything out of this. It's just basically talking about, in quotations, the politics of scheduling and stuff. I don't think you like will like that, so run along. As for us adults and teenagers, let's talk. All right. So if you guys remember, we were doing good with Superman and Lois after they decided to do another pause. They did the first pause. It's like, oh, woohoo. Yeah, because, well, you know, this time they had the virus to blame. Then after that, we come back again, and they go all the way to, I think, July or something. Yeah, we had to wait, like, weeks, weeks for them to be, to return back. And then finally, they return back, and, well, it's not as bad as Walker, because we'll get to Walker in a minute. But for <laughs> Superman and Lois, it's like, we give you this new, yeah, here's a new episode, here's the new episode. All right. Then after the new episode ends, lo and behold, the season finale is next week. What the fuck? What the make a ton of fuck? Hey, dumbasses. Couldn't you just freaking do the right damn ass thing and, you know, allow the freaking series to go for two more freaky damn weeks and then you can do your dumb, stupid hiatus bullshit. Just saying. Because you're telling me I had to wait all the way till now. And then after that, you show me kind of a middle finger of here's the season finale. Go fuck yourself. And it's like, dude, you're making me wait all this time just for two more damn episodes. That's some bullshit. That's some serious bullshit. But let's get into Walker now. Walker is a brand new rodeo where we already know it's the season finale. But we still had to wait weeks on end until they do the freaking damn season finale. And it's like, this is some bullshit. Do it freaking damn now. So you don't have to be like, okay, well, there you go. And now we can get started with it. It's like, I don't give a shit about your freaking damn buffer. I don't give a crap about your damn ass buffer. And you're like, oh, we got to make sure we're able to start something at a certain time. Well, then do the damn freaking I don't give a crap about your whole thing of, oh, well, if we ended at that point, then who's to say they would come back and watch? I don't give a crap. Let me finish, damn it. Okay. Oh, um, well, what the, okay, hold on a second. So we got. Okay, so what's going on is we have Legends of Tomorrow. Okay, Legends of Tomorrow's happening. Okay. That is a friggin' damn stupid tomorrow. Okay. Okay. Then after Legends of Stupid Damn Tomorrow, that's what they have for that one. And hold on. So 17, uh, 18, 19, 20. Okay, there we go. I forgot to push this. Hopefully it won't revert it back. Yes, it did. Son of a big. Okay, hold on. I'm just finding out what's taking Walker's place. It's like, what's the freaking special show that you're going to show that's like, yeah, check it out, folks. We got it just warm for you. Dynasty. That's what they're waiting for is Dynasty. Wait, no, never mind. Or Burning of Truth. So it's either Burning of Truth or Dynasty. I think it's Burning of Truth. You're going to make them wait for Burning of Truth. People who are watching Walker is not really actually interested in burning the truth. Plus, you're on season damn ass four. So, <laughs> yeah, it's pretty late to actually be like, yes, and we have to do the buffer on it too. Uh -huh. It's like, no, no. No one's going to be interested in your damn ass freaking damn show. <laughs> it's like the only shows now you have that are pretty decent is The Flash, but lots of people kind of have some issues. Superman and Lois and Walker. Legend of Tomorrow, as soon as they did the Legend of the Bullshit, then all of a sudden they pulled a freaking 
the Disney Bolt, the end of Bolt. Have you seen that? That that movie? Yeah, if you know what happened in that movie, they did exactly the same shit, and that's why I didn't return. And also, let's be on the bullshit. Sorry, but no. Then Batwoman did the same thing. Let's be on the bullshit. I'm out. See ya. <laughs> Supergirl is a different story where it's like, yes, they have let's be on the bullshit, but. All right, sorry. They have the Leslie on the bullshit, but the thing is, is that they allow Lex Luthor to get depowered very quickly. Lex Luthor with power would have made a nice last season, but fuck that. You got rid of his powers like very, very quickly. And it's like, go f yourselves. You, it's like, this is the first time ever Lex has powers and is not freaking Brainiac in control. Or, you know, hopped up on freaking kryptonite juice. This is the first time you were able to do that shit. And then you got rid of the powers, like, as soon as possible. And I'm like, yeah, I'm sorry, but you got rid of the best thing you had. Go f*** yourself. I don't care if John Cryer costs a lot of damn ass money. Go f*** yourself. You had something very, very good here, and you threw it away. Go f*** yourself. I'm done. <laughs> That's what they did for Supergirl. It's like, yeah, they got rid of um, Le um, not Lex. They got rid of. <sighs> they got rid of. I forgot the the girl, sister's name, but yeah, they got rid of her heritage sexuality, and that was really a bummer. That was really extreme bummer, bummer. But yeah, um, <clears throat> still though. The whole I could have I could have actually continued on and be okay with it if they didn't freak it over with the whole Lex. No, you can't get powers anymore. Lex, you have one power. You get powers for like at least close to one episode, spanning from two episodes. Go f yourself, and it's like yeah, then go f yourself. I don't want to watch it because you got rid of the best thing ever, and then you got rid of it. I'm pretty sure there's many other people who would dream to have a storyline where Lex get powers and now he can screw up, screw over Superman or and or Supergirl and or Steel and or Superboy and or it's like, yes, and you just threw that shit away. Wow. But yeah, I'm just here to talk about how messed up CW is doing right now. And yes, we could say the stupid damn virus, but personally, I'm like, no, they could have done better. And I hope they do better next time. Don't do any of this bullshit ever again. Just let the freaking show happen. And also, fuck you for allowing Flash being on the same time as Lego Masters. That was the worst thing ever, you dumb bastards. You should have just held off on it and put it somewhere that isn't damaging. Just saying. She's gonna get it. Oh, she's gonna